All right, let's talk Dewalt shop stools here. This is a swivel stool, and I sit out here all the damn time. I got the heater on here in the garage because it's 50 degrees here. Anyway, long story short, this thing is just grinding like the bearings are catching or something. So this morning I decided I'd check it out and see what the hell's going on with this stool. And let me put this thing upside down. And what turns out is that these were all loose. These aren't the original bolts. I'll show you in here what the original bolts look like, but they were all loose. This is what it came with. These cheap freaking, I don't know, soft. I mean, they don't have any weight to them. They're all kind of stripped out, all right? And luckily I had some metric bolts that fit in there nice and good and tight. I think the uh, the nut is fine. It's just that the bolt stripped out. Now the problem I'm having is that, as you can see, there isn't much distance between the bolt that mounts to the stool and then the bolt that mounts to the actual seat portion. And now it kind of catches. So what I had to do is go online and find another swivel plate. And I found one here for 19 bucks. And you can see it has a good one inch dealy whacker on there. Uh, spacing. <clears throat> that should be coming in tomorrow. But, uh, man, I tell you, it just kind of pisses me off. You know, Dewalt, you think we'd pull its head out of its ass and make better hardware. I can't even get an Allen head on this. And thankfully, they were all loose. I could just take them off by hand. All right, check this out. So I got the new swivel plate for this Dewalt shop stool to replace this one right here. This is the new one. This is super heavy duty. Nice and wide right there compared to the spacing here. You got like no spacing. But check out the problem I'm going to have. Do you see it? How the hell am I going to get these out? They're freaking ground over. Looks like I have to drill them out. And then put some bolts in there. Look at that. It's fucking crap. This heavy duty heavy duty all right wish me luck all right winner winner chicken freaking dinner so i got the new swivel plate put on the dewalt stool here and i didn't have to drill out these bolts right here that go to the stool frame thank goodness i didn't have to do that these these are the ones that i had to take out they were so freaking loose I just used some channel lock pliers and got them out just fine. So this thing is attached with lock washers now on all of them. And I have some of this Master Pro Marine Grease. And I dabbed the bearings there real good. Another good shot. And this thing is freaking great now. A little stiff, but you know what? When you sit on it, it has great freaking movement. This is the way it should have been made. This thing is bent. This is the original sw swivel plate. You look at that. You can see the bend. It's freaking bent. <laughs> and men, look at it right there and right there. It's freaking junk. Junk hardware. God dang, what does it take? A freaking DIYer to figure this stuff out? And I don't have an engineering degree. All right. Nice freaking movement. Nice. Doesn't make a sound, doesn't make any jerky movements. Perfect.